Nice cat named Earl is ready to explore thanks to a new set of wheels. Our Kimberly Craig introduces us to the organization that helped him get back on his feet. <laughs> Earl is quite the cat. He's so swift you might have to do a double take to realize his back legs are paralyzed. But that has not stopped this little guy from getting around with his family. He goes camping. He goes to Costco. I take him everywhere. The Romanellis fostered and then adopted Earl about a year ago from their last resort rescue. He was just about five weeks old when someone spotted him and could see something was terribly wrong. Earl was found um, run, trying to run across the street and go up the curb to follow his litter mates and his mother and Earl couldn't get, make it up the curb. But today is Earl's big day. He's getting a wheelchair designed just for him. You're doing good, Earl. A designer with C3 Ventures in Flint used 3D printing to engineer this wheelchair for Earl. And recently they used the technology to build a bill for an injured duck. And this wheelchair will help give Earl some relief after he developed a lump on his back from dragging his body around. I've always loved animals and the thought of being able to help a cat be able to walk with something else that I love, which is engineering and 3D printing. That was just amazing to me. And Earl is one amazing cat. He even has his own Facebook page with fans around the world, helping homeless animals and inspiring people to think beyond any barriers. He um, has shown kids firsthand determination and with a little bit of effort and energy that they can achieve anything. So by getting these wheels, he's showing everyone that nothing can stop him. Come on, buddy. Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Looks like... That'll take some getting used to for him. You yeah, but uh, oh, getting the hang great. of it pretty quick. Yeah, new lease on life for uh, <laughs> that cat Earl that's got nine lives anyway, right, right? right? So maybe nine and a half lives, right? <laughs> Whatever.